In this video I'm going to make standard deviation super easy. Once you get to the end of this you'll wonder why you even had to look up this video. Standard deviation is really easy to do and if we do it this way hopefully you'll understand exactly what's going on. So this formula looks initially intimidating but if we rewrite this in words it's so obvious what this actually means. So let's just rewrite this in words which makes sense. So basically what you're doing is add up, that's what this symbol means here, add up the differences with the mean. This is your point minus it, the mean and then you square it. And the thing that happens when you square a number is it makes it always positive. So if if the mean was bigger you would get a negative number and if you square it it's always positive so it's the absolute um, difference rather than the plus and minus differences and then at the bottom we've got number minus one so we take, we've got the number of the things we subtract one that's the n minus one and this top bit is basically saying add up all of the differences with the mean and square it that's and it's set of instructions in math speak and this is of course the square root What's the x bar? Well, this is the mean, and that basically just says add them up and then just count them. Very simple. And let's do an example just to show you this in practice. So let's take 2, 6, 5, and 3. So the mean, well, we're saying add them up, so 2 plus 6 plus 5 plus 3 count them, 1, 2, 3, 4, and so we've got 2 plus 6 is 8, plus 5 is 13, plus 3 is 16, so we get 16 divided by 4, and that is of course 4, so the mean is 4. Now let's do the standard deviation, so let's just write this out again, so we've got 2, 6, 5, and 3, and now we'll follow this instruction. So we want the difference with the mean, so we'll just put minus 4 here, so find the difference with the mean for a step. So we've got 2 minus 4 is minus 2. We've got 6 minus 4, well that's going to be 2. 5 minus 4 is 1. 3 minus 4 is minus 1. And square these. So minus 2 squared is 4. Almost going to write 2, but no, minus 2 squared is 4. 2 squared, that's 4. 1 squared is 1. Minus 1 squared is 1. And then we just add these up. So basically add them up. What do we get? 4 plus 4 is 8, 9, 10. So we get 10. So here's our instructions. So let's just fill out these instructions. So, uh, so we've done this. We've added them up and we've squared them. So 10 can go in that place. The number, well, 1, 2, 3, 4, minus 1. So 4 minus 1, square root. And if you do that, you'll get, round, with rounding, um, 1.83. And that's the standard deviation done. Very, very simple. Just write out the numbers, subtract the mean from each of the numbers, um, square each of them, and then add them all up, and then just substitute in. That's all standard deviation is. Extremely simple. So hopefully this video has been helpful to you. You now should have no problems with standard deviation. And finally, thank you for watching.